Learning more about a car accident in Fort Smith ended with a 13-year-old boy killed. Thanks for joining us for your 5 News at 10. I'm Darren Bob. And I'm Erica Thomas. We first brought you this story as breaking news in your 5 News at 6. 5 News reporter Michael Wilson is live near Tillis Park in Fort Smith with an update from police. Micah. Darren and Erica, we're here off 37th and Grand Avenue in Fort Smith, where police wrapped up a nearly three and a half hour investigation here on the scene. Now we spoke with Fort Smith police. They say they don't believe anything was intentional. They believe it was just all an unfortunate and tragic accident. Tuesday evening around five, Fort Smith police responding to calls of a car hitting a child pedestrian near Tillis Park on Grand Avenue. The 13 year old Hispanic male was involved as the pedestrian. Police say the teen was at a park playing with friends and was being chased or chasing a dog into the street where he was hit by a car. The driver of the vehicle was on scene, obviously very shook up about what had occurred. Um, completely cooperative. Police say the driver did not seem to be under the influence, but the 13 year old was taken to the hospital due to head injuries and he later died. This is hard. I mean, it's, it's something that really rocks the community. The teen has not been identified at this time, but we do know he is a student at Fort Smith Public Schools. Right now, police say they believe no foul play was involved. Just right now, it appears like it's just a, a tragic accident. Now we spoke with Fort Smith police. They say they have notified the parents and I also reached out to Fort Smith Public Schools. They tell me that they will have counselors and support staff tomorrow at school uh, to help out with students. We're live here in Fort Smith covering news where you live. Mike Wilson, 5 News. All right, Micah, thanks. That section of Grand Avenue near 37th Street reopened about 90 minutes ago. New